The future is here and it's in Racine. Fox 6's Evan Peterson shows us the city's newest fully autonomous self-driving van. It is my distinct pleasure to introduce to all of you today uh, the Racine Badger, uh, which is our autonomous vehicle right here. The newest car to take up residence in the Gateway Technical College parking lot is arguably more of a computer than an automobile. Many people think about connected and automated vehicle technology as something that's you know far off in the future. But as, of, as today is going to demonstrate, the future is now. The Racine Badger is an autonomous shuttle, meaning thanks to an immense system of geomapping, numerous sensors, cameras, and complicated algorithms, this van drives itself. We will start down here in the parking lots and on Pershing Park Drive, but the ambition is to make the city itself a laboratory for experimentation on this emerging technology around mobility and transit. Monday's demonstration shows this technology's growth locally, but the state's transportation secretary says what's being worked on here goes far beyond city limits. Long before vehicles like the Badger here are common on streets, Wisconsin will be using this technology to enable emergency vehicles, snow plows, and other official vehicles to communicate with traffic management systems to ensure better response times and emergencies. For now, it's just a prototype, but rest assured, this technology is coming to a city street near you. In Racine, Evan Peterson, Fox 6 News. It is the future. For now, it's only being tested on select city streets. No word yet on if or when city residents will be able to check it out for themselves. <laughs>